win? I think so. Oh, Jimmy, Patty Mae, I've been waiting for you. That's my fault. I was running late. Are you sure you're up for this, Jimmy? How do you feel? I feel... Guilty. 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 Jimmy! Yes, sir. What are you doing? Just taking out the trash. Go ahead and get started on the dishes. Actually, I was hoping to talk with you uh, about the sauce. Just a couple more customers and I can lock up. Later. The dishes can't wait. Stir my sauce. I'm coming back. Mr. Hicks, I, I really want to talk with you about the sauce. I think it's time you tell me what's in the sauce. I mean, you have to pass it along sooner or later. Nobody wants it more than me. No. Now, get back to my sauce before it burns. Matter of fact, you can go ahead and bottle that batch as soon as you're done with the dishes. When are you ever gonna tell somebody the recipe? I mean, I've been working hard for you for years, and all for what, nothing? It's not for nothing, it's for a paycheck. It's so you can have food on your table and money to pay your bills. Wash the dishes and help Patty Mae lock up. Well, front's all locked up. I am pooped. Oh, Jimmy. You know he's gonna give you the sauce someday. You're the only one. Here, walk me out. Ellis! I'm out of here, old man. Jimmy? Finish up the sauce in the dishes and go on and get out of here too. Oh! It is colder than a witch's tit out here. Hi, Jimmy. There's nothing left. It all burnt to the ground. Everything is lost. Not everything, Jimmy. We're still here. Patty Mae's right. Everything's not lost. Mr. Hicks left you everything, whether it be the restaurant or at the bank. The bank? It turns out Mr. Hicks had quite a bit of money saved up, as well as a copy of the barbecue sauce recipe locked up in the safety deposit box. 